Hi Shopify developer, welcome to another video. In this video, I will be talking about how you can use Cloudflare channel with the Shopify app CLI to get a custom domain URL for your Shopify app development server. And it will be the same one when you are running your development server that will be very helpful when you are developing your Shopify app. So that's it for the intro and let's go back to the screen and I will show you how you can do it. So let's get started. In this tutorial, I will be using the official Shopify Remix template and the Cloudflare channel as we mentioned in the intro. So let's get started. So let's run npm install. Awesome, so everything is installed. Let's run npm pm run dev. And I will connect it. Let's create a new one. I will call it Cloudflare channel. Awesome, so everything is currently connected. So let's open up code. As you can see, it does update client ID and also add the redirect URL. And it should be a unique one each time that we run npm run dev. Maybe let's install it. Okay that's good so the next thing that we will do is go to the cloudflare dashboard and go to zero trust it will open up this dashboard go to networks go to the tunnel and click on create tunnel selected the recommended one and let's name it cloudflare tunnel app click on save tunnel and we need to install and run the connector in our machine and I'm currently using Mac so I will be using Bro to install Cloudflare to be able to run it so let's open up a new terminal windows and let's place it here so as you can see I will be installing Cloudflare and install this server this service and I should type my password it's already run if you already have Cloudflare server running because it should be only one server let's run npm Cloudflare in install and and, inst and install it after that as you can see here it's currently up and running and installed successfully let's click on next and here, here we would like to set up our unique URL. And here I will be using my podcast domain. And I will, for the subdomain, I will call it app. In the service, I will be using HTTP. And in the URL, I will be using localhost for 8080. And after that, click on save tunnel and it has been successfully saved the settings as you can see it's healthy and let's go back to our Shopify app kill the server and let's run npm run dev dash 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 tunnel url and it should be pointing to our app dot yalla let's code com and the port I will be using is 8080 and currently we can just click on P preview it and we can double check that we are using our Cloudflare tunnel from here as you can see here in the tumble file in the redirect URL we have app.yellowletscode.com slash oauth slash callback it's using our custom channel URL so that's it for this video 
I hope you find it useful. If you find it useful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment on this video. And let's see you on the next one.